Hello Pisces, this is the Zero Queen Jamila and I am doing a mini reading for next week for you. Um, and so this is going to be a three card spread <clears throat> for April the 18th, starting beginning April 18th for the week of April 18th and April the 24th. So uh, this is going to be a quick past, present, future spread for you. Um, make sure that you hit the subscribe button and you thumbs up this video. And also for a personalized reading, um, check out my website in the video description box. All right. Uh-oh. Okay. Uh-oh. Cards are turning over. But that was just, that was me that did that. Okay. Alright, so uh, currently uh, you got the Page of Pentacles, so um, Pisces, I can, and, I, and I was seeing you was having some trouble last week with this Page of Pentacles, I think. This is a messenger that does not have your best interest at heart, and this person is just meddling, and they're nosy, and they're younger than you, and they're childish. They may not be physically younger than you, and you know what is funny? Because... <laughs> On the illustration of the Page of Pentacles, and I'm not lying, if you look, go look go look up the tarot of the Deviant Moon tarot deck, it is something that looks like a penis coming out of his head. So this is literally a dickhead. This is somebody that I, I know I've, I have dealt with somebody. This is somebody meddling in your love life, and they probably have a crush on you or they're just, you know, kind of some kind of deep jealousy. Um, or maybe they just have some unsettled spirits inside of them. Uh, the Page of Pentacles is uh, carrying a inverted pentacle, which shows that he is definitely coming with some dark energies. And the intentions that he has is to dismantle things because he has a wrench in his hand. So he's there to pick things apart. That is something that Pisces people do not like. They do not like being picked apart. And I'm the same way because I'm a cancer, but Pisces are really, really very sensitive. They're more sensitive than, than the cancer because they're the fish. So they don't have the hard exterior that cancers have. And um, so what they do is they just swim in the other direction. Now, I can see in the past there was definitely some chaos. So I... I'm seeing this energy that it's got to be somebody. It's an enemy of yours, Pisces. And you got to, I, I can see this in the past. So hopefully your future card is better because you got to remember you are the one manifesting things. A lot of times when you're running from something, it's really from yourself. Um, and so a lot of times when I take this card, I take it as this I literally being him, this person running from themselves and they're, because one of the eyes is crazy when you look at this illustration because one of the eyes is like spinning in a spiral and the other one is a regular eyeball. So his eyeball is actually, you're the one manifesting this stuff. And so you just got to find yourself, which is the church, which is balance, okay, which is the two pillars in the back that look like the Twin Towers and the Deviant Moon Tarot. Um, in the future, you did get the Six of Wands. So this person that you're dealing with, they are going to give you public recognition. I see that happening in the future. Or if you are dating a Pisces, the Pisces is going to be strong enough to say, hey, you know, I want this person, you know, and... It's, I really love this card. This is a card of celebration. So if any of you Pisces out there, again, this isn't going to resonate for all of you, but any of you Pisces out there that are missing somebody, um, the six is the number of return. So, um, or I just see this is happening now. If you are already involved with someone, that is what I mean. So Pisces are known for their little secret love affairs. <laughs> And um, so, yeah, they will keep you secret, you know, for a very long time so that they don't have to deal with the controversy of the relationship. They don't want to have to explain it to people. I should know that because I dated a Pisces years and years ago, but he's moved on to someone else and so have I. 
But I, you know, and I wouldn't even know if this I could do a reading on him if I wanted, but I'm not interested. But the six of wands um is just saying that there's that the energy is gonna be of public recognition, public displays of affection, a lot of protection. This is the male energy really protecting the female energy a lot. And that's pretty cool, Pisces. So that's going to do it, you guys. I've done all 12 Zodiacs. I hope you guys enjoy this series for next week. Um, definitely check out my website. I do offer um, same-day readings also. Um, sometimes I do need a couple of hours notice, and sometimes I don't. Also, um, if you go to my website periodically dur uh, during the day, I do have hours set where I am available by live chat during the week so if you are on the site and you have questions um there's chat support right at the bottom right and that's actually me behind the chat support so thank you for watching thank you for subscribing and and also make sure that you um become a patreon if you want fund my channel um so that it can get better and grow and improve um so definitely hit um go to my homepage and you'll be able to see where you can go and donate to my channel okay thank you for watching bye